Welcome back to the Suri and Su Talk Show, Cottage Talk, reaching beyond the boundaries of social growth. We're very excited today we have the man of the hour, yes. Forrest. Welcome <laughs> back to Cottage Talk. Thank you. You're here for the Nollywood Film Festival. Yes, I am. Whoa. Uh, and also TIFF. So. And also TIFF. Yeah, you're right. You're here for TIFF as well. <laughs> That's two, yeah. two, two uh, film festivals in one for me. Wow. Yeah. So what has your experience been since you, you know, show up? Wow. As, as always, uh, film festivals are, are, are uh, a place you come once a year, and sometimes there could be seven of them in one year, and you are constantly talking, planning, projecting for the next two years, yes. and at, at the same time promoting some things you have. In this case, mm -hmm. uh, we just launched our film company, Tactical Film, so that uh, has taken my level as mm -hmm. someone in the industry to a whole nother level. Okay. So I'm not just a guy in front of it now. I have to talk with distributors, I have to talk to um, old associates and people I've worked with in the past in other films. At the same time, I'm also promoting three other films of my all coming out within the next from now to 2018, 2019. Wow. So yeah, so it's been busy, but very good busy. Do you want to share with us some of those um, movies that's coming out? Yes, uh, I have. Uh, we have the uh, first one is Redcon 1. It's a zombie apocalypse film. Whoa. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And it's, it's a surprise. It's an uh, all action, high octane. Um, those who know me from my very action background, from yes. the adventures of Sinbad, I don't have to realize a lot of you people. Uh, Simba I'm fan. Still big fans of, this, <laughs> of this beautiful TV series that started my career. And, yes. Um, I think that's uh, that, and, uh, and I remember Highlander. So it's pretty much. Hold on, uh, hold on. Yes. The Highlander? Hi Highlander 4. Oh, I love that yes, movie. That's good. I, I didn't I, know I, you were I, in I, it. I was wearing the baddies with, with Dunny and, 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 and quite a few people. So, you know, uh, I think back into action. Uh, in this zombie apocalypse, it's called Record One. Then I have uh, two other films. Uh, one of them is uh, is uh, with an award-winning uh, Toronto, and uh, <clears throat> he's one he's a young director by the name of Kibu. He's an award-winning mm -hmm. director for the Toronto Film Festival as well as Tribeca Films. Wow! And, uh, and another one called Love in the Age of, of Fear, which is set in um, the pre-Brexit. Uh, situation so you know with that and uh, this weekend uh, on the yes. 16th I believe of yes. September we we're releasing online um, the cursed ones uh, which the cursed is, ones it's called uh, flicks premiere wow so that's an online release uh -huh. uh, Europe on the 16th then on the 29th Canada and America can view it online on yes the 29th. wow yeah so yeah, it's been it's been a busy period you you just blow me out of my chair right now Horace because you're working on some big stuff you're not just a Nollywood actor, but you are a Hollywood actor. A you, you are a, what can I say, you know, titles that I can hardly call today. Well, I, I, I like to say I, I, I am an actor. I'm an actor who works in all different atmospheres. Yes. I mean, that's my, that's my job. Mm -hmm. um, I, I don't really like to, I, I appreciate the Hollywood, Nollywood thing, but at the end of the day, I am a man of many faces. That's yes. what I mean. This is something I've been doing for 27 years. So I do stage, I do theater, yeah, I do it all. You do it all. Yeah, I'm just so you, you you put me. Even now, it's it's very different because every film I'm doing now, mm -hmm. five films, as the main leading character. Wow. So I've come from supporting, mm -hmm. being the number five, number three to the number one guy that carries the film. Yes. It's you you it it, it and as well as executive producer. Yes. It, it, things change. You become more of a uh, Oh, yeah. perfect. I'm going to pick your brain a bit because we sure. spent some time yesterday talking and I understand now you're behind the scene. You're not just yeah. in front of the scene that you're, you know, on stage doing your stuff, but yeah. you are working the business aspect of this yeah. business. What would you like to see for our people in this industry? I want to see the next generation, um, especially those coming out of film schools or those who happen to want to know more about the industry. I want to see more apprenticeship with the next generation, with my generation. So yes. You have, you have the very established actors taking on the next generation, giving them a shot. So mm -hmm. you have a great DP. Yes. You must um, 
you know, you have a great, you, you, you give a young yes. cinema photographer a kid that wants to know more about it while they're going to college to get yes. their masters and study film school. I, I think we we need to expand in that arena, mm -hmm. uh, bring both generations together, both atmospheres together. Yes. Um, and, and that's the, the premise of uh, our, uh, our film company, Tactical yes. Films. Wow. Um, and that's uh, that's the plan, that when we go to Africa, when we go to India, wherever we're shooting, mm -hmm. um, you know, it has to be five to one ratio. So you have yes. one cameraman, I need to see five kids that's never, they understand film, you know, you yes. see the kids these days, they, yeah. they're doing stuff on their cell phones that will blow some people away in the Hollywood world. Yeah. You know what I mean? And and, 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 and that, that, that will be will be a dream come true. And well, it's not a dream come true, it's happening. Yeah. To, 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 to see that, and I want to see more women, yes. uh, uh, especially a lot of young women, uh, and I want to work with a lot of female directors. So for me, it's yes. it's, it's a whole it's 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 not about black or white. It's yes. about that individual that wants to work. Wow. So I, I, you know, for me, it's never been about black film, white films. I, I mean, two of the films I have coming out were were set for white characters, mm -hmm. white lead characters. I walked in the room, they didn't see white, they didn't see black. They saw the person that was right for the character and I want to see that yes. with producers, I want to see that with, with, with art directors, with next generation, so, mm -hmm. and it's about, it's about setting that tone of legacy, yes. at the same time making money, mm -hmm. you know what I mean, we can't, you know, it's just a business and, and it's very important that um, we have a generation that's not going to treat the industry like it's a part-time job, yes. it's a full-time job, it is a full-time job, I've done this for 27 years and that's, yes. it's a full-time job, yes, just it like is. being a doctor, just like being mm -hmm. a, you, you, and most of the people you would see at the festivals, they've been doing it for 50, 60 years, feed fit, but they feed their kids and families. And wow. So that's what I want to see. Yes. Uh, and I need the next generation to know that this is not just about being famous. It's a business. Yes. When a bank or someone gives you money to make a film, it's very important that you respect that. Wow. That this is serious stuff. That is deep. So yeah. I, I can't ask anymore to say thank you very much for taking your time. You're I know welcome. you're you're here for the movie premiere and I'm taking up your time, guys. Uh, but thank you so much. No, thank you for coming to Cottage thank Talk. You. Appreciate thank it. You. Yes. Appreciate thank it. Thank you. Yeah. Well, you've heard it in the Suyan Su Talk Show. Horace representing for Cottage Talk. Yo! <laughs> <laughs> Cottage Talk. That's right.